we very seldom lose two games back to back, and we did. We need to win two more games. They were saying that we were not going to win those last two, and uh, we're not going to make the playoffs, and uh, it would be the first time in my career that we wouldn't uh, make the playoffs that year. So some leaders stepped up in the, off our team and, and called a meeting, uh, and, and we uh, all met together. We kicked all the coaches out, including the head coach, um, and we all just uh, got together and figured out what we need to do to, to take our games to the next level. We took ownership of our team. We went on to win the last two games. We made the playoffs. And we went in the playoffs with the attitude that, you know, we're here now, let's make something happen. And we go into the Super Bowl, and we have two minutes left in the game. And we have to move the ball 94 yards down the field. And we haven't lost the Super Bowl yet, you know, so this is, this is scary, you know? <laughs> That's where you saw the West Coast offense come together at its best because it was not just one player that was dominating, making, making it happen. Everyone was utilized. They all played a role in, in this West Coast. It was beautiful to see. It was like jazz coming together. You know, we have the quarterback who's the, the conductor. He's able to put all this, those components together and make beautiful music, and we did it. <laughs> 